1963, the upstairs of this building was the Carousel Club, a burlesque house operated by Jack Ruby. A Dallas Utility Company employee, who was then a part-time cab driver, said that during this period, he once picked up Lee Harvey Oswald, David W. Ferry, and an unidentified older man and brought them to the club. The witness, a former Texas peace officer named Raymond Cummings, was interrogated recently by investigators for New Orleans District Attorney Jim Garrison. Cummings has told the Dallas District Attorney's Office that he telephoned Garrison after reading that David Ferry had never been in Dallas. Cummings claimed, in fact, that he had known Ferry in Dallas even prior to picking him up. Ferry, a former Airlines pilot, was found dead in his New Orleans apartment soon after Garrison's investigation of him began. Cummings also said that on another occasion, he picked up Lee Harvey Oswald at a Dallas bus station and took him to Irving. Tomorrow, Cummings and his lawyer will meet with Assistant Dallas District Attorney Bill Alexander to make a formal statement about these matters. Cummings is represented by Dallas Attorney Frank Wright. Today, neither Cummings nor Wright would talk with newsmen. This is James Kerr reporting. During that period, I picked up a man in my cab who I later found to be Lee Harvey Oswald. We talked at length on the way to the address he had given me. Several months later, and to the best of my memory, in early 1963, I was driving my taxi and was stopped by three men. I recognized one of the men as being Lee Harvey Oswald, and we spoke about our previous meeting. I have recently learned from seeing photos that a second man was David Faree. I cannot identify the third party. At their request, I took the three men to the Carousel Club on Commerce Street in Dallas, Texas, and they left my cab. Why did you come for it then? Because of the publicity it was in this here, and due to the fact that I did at that time fear uh, for my family. Having been a policeman, didn't you trust the police to protect you? Yeah, uh, I'll Yes, sir. Uh, and a former Marine, the FBI, and other government bodies? Well, Mr. Coleman, he also knew about the entertainer at the carousel, I imagine, who claimed he saw someone in the place and what happened to him afterward. He what? had a lot of harassment and I think he wound up in Illinois somewhere. You did knew you, about him, didn't you? Did you think yes. if you waited uh, three years that you wouldn't get any publicity? Well, I was hoping not. Thank you.